Hey babes, it's me, Courtney, and we are doing a very special Picture It episode. In honor of our four year anniversary this March 25th, 2019, we had you, the Stay Golden community, ask me a bunch of questions that I promised I would answer you. All right, all right, I can pick up a cue. Picture it. Four years ago, I was, we'll say, politely asked to leave forever, a job that was practically ruining my psyche and my life. Well, think of your worst job and that was what I was living and I'm gonna totally admit it, I was in therapy and I'm a total proponent and on board with you getting your mental health in order the way you need it to. What would you do if you could do something that wasn't for money but was for fun that brought you happiness? I like the Golden Girls and I like making videos and writing. Combined all three, started Stay Golden with Chris out of my apartment here in Crown Heights. You make one video and then second video and third and fourth and you just keep moving forward until we arrived here at year four with playlists, 20, 2,000 plus subscribers, hosting bingo, talking to you guys in the comments, and that's that's how we started. That's how I, I started and I haven't, I haven't stopped. I think I've talked about this in some of my Golden Grades episodes. My grandmother, Bertha, and she helped raise, take care of me when I was younger. We watched the show together. I laughed and it was funny, she laughed, it was something we enjoyed and then I found it again when I was older and it was still something that we could share. Uh, grandma, for as many of you have also mentioned, bringing it into my life. Of the four main characters of the girls, I, I am, I'm Dorothy. I was a substitute teacher for a while once <laughs> and she worked at camps over the summer and I've worked at camps. There's a lot of similarities. Ladies and gentlemen, it is hard. It is rewarding. I love the Stay Golden community. I love making videos. It is also hard. Having a YouTube channel is like having a second job. We have our day job and then we have our Stay Golden job. We are constantly thinking of, all right, what's the schedule? What are we producing? What do we have to film? What do we have to write? What's in the edit? What's in the can? What do we have to promote? Oh, is there an opportunity to collaborate? Oh, like, this uh, thing happened in pop culture. Can we capitalize on it? And how fast can we turn it around? I'll be real frank with you guys. A lot of the time when I'm doing something else, I feel anxious that I'm not working on the channel. When somebody writes me in a golden grades after I've asked a question and we're having a conversation about a topic and you're like, oh my God, this really opened up something for me or you share something with me about your life and how the show's affected you or how we, kind of entered your life through the channel, that is absolutely great. Having that opportunity and conversation, I love having that facet of the YouTube channel, but it is a grind. Like you can't see right now, but we are in our Brooklyn apartment, right? It is, I don't have a watch, but 8 p.m. on a Thursday, We've got the lights up. We, we have an office at home and we film and I'm, here I am making a video. The day has not ended. First choice, best choice. Yes. So uh, which one of you isn't going? <laughs> well, uh, I'm the one who won the tickets. Yeah, but my mom's the one who's bailing us out. I lost Butter Queen. Haven't I suffered enough? <laughs> I lost Butter Queen. Haven't I suffered enough? It just, I mean, I can't do Betty White justice in that moment, but there's something about that, that sequence I will laugh in a completely empty room on my own. Stan's a secondary character. I think he had the greatest impact. He affects each of the girls' lives at various points throughout the seven seasons. He's moved in with them at some points. They've taken care of him in a, like, a weird, obscure way. I would um, also say that Lucas Hollingsworth had the greatest impact on the show because he, though coming in in the very last two episodes of the entire show's run, marries Dorothy and takes her away from 6151 Richmond Street and they start a new life together. So he, in that sense, has the biggest impact on the show because 
Dorothy's not there for the Golden Palace, right? Like, they have to move on without her. So, in a, like, a weird way, he's very powerful, too. Ordinarily, at the end of the picture, our guest tells you where you can find them, what they're working on, all of their social media handles. You guys know me. You can find me here at Stay Golden. Every Tuesday at 10 a.m., we release new videos. You can comment below, email us to say hi. Thank you guys for being a friend, for being a subscriber, for just being awesome. And as always, stay golden out there.